Here. Welcome back to MBU Reacts. Today we got more Drake. Taylor May freestyle. You know, I already know Kendrick Lamar is. Damn, this is a hand rub. Yeah, like, <laughs> Aubrey Graham. Wheelchair Jimmy. He said, I'm throwing shots. You ain't responding fast enough. Heard he used AI in this to mimic some voices, but we're here to check it out. Let's get into it. What if he spoke a word this nigga? That'd be crazy. That'd be wild. Does rise again. Tupac? Tupac? You can see it in my eyes again. West Coast has beat. West, West. I just see a low rider pull up. we need ya. The West Coast savior. Ain't great in your name and some hip hop history. If you deal with this bitch. Already, I hey Drake, a menace. Already. Drake is a menace ass, Nick. We are 23 <laughs> seconds in. Nigga. The West Coast you see I knew you an asshole, nigga. Yeah, that's crazy. He ran those mess around the studios like I'm releasing this. The West Coast savior ain't great in your name and some hip hop history. If you deal with this viciously, you seem a little nervous about all the publicity. This Canadian light skin dot. We need to know the baby West Coast victory, man. Call him a bitch for me. Talk about him liking young girls. That's a kid for me. Heard it on the button podcast. It's gotta be true. They told me to spare the spare the belly is alive. Oh, and a nigga under five foot five, so it's gotta be you. I would beat Damn. the whole fucking game. It was me and Snoop Dogg. Had my fucking shirt off in the house of blues. Can you gotta fuck this nigga, girl? He gotta get abused. All that shit about burning tattoos, he is not amused. That's jail talk for real thugs. You gotta be you. Gotta leave this motherfucker broken and bruised before we really lose. You ask for the smoke, now I seen you too busy for the smoke. I won't lie to you. Damn, we said you asked for the smoke, now I seem like you too busy for the smoke. Nigga, this is just Drake sound like Tupac, which is amazing. Or right, it's just AI, because you know, they mm. you just chat like you just type in some shit. Damn. Nigga. Remember, RDC did it on that. Facts, you ain't lying. Damn, what if it, yeah, it could be just AI. I thought he modified it. I thought he was, but you're right, it could be just it AI. It could just be AI, or it could be him rapping, change, then they modify his voice. Either way it goes, it's still crazy. He's wild for this. <laughs> Before we really lose, you ask for the smoke. Now I seen you too busy for the smoke. I won't lie, the people confused. Now you about to get this shit another week. And fall back to home, girl, but running numbers up. I would have refused. For these industry relationships, she not in your shoes. You supposed to be the boogie man, go do what you do. Unless this is a moment that you tell us it's not really you. In that case, there's nothing left to say. I just pass it to snow. Yes, you. What the fuck you really got to do? Passed you the torch at the house of blues And now you gotta do some dirty work You know how to move, right? Right? I know you've never been to jail Or was jumpsuits and shower shoes Never shot nobody, never stabbed nobody Never did nothing violent and no one It's the homies that empower you But still, you gotta show this fucking aisle Who's boss on the west? Now's the time to really make a power They say you gotta show this aisle This fucking aisle <laughs> Hey, drink a menace, cause at first I thought this was really Snoop. <laughs> that sounded just like him. Nah, I was like, why Snoop on here? This is AI for both of them. That is crazy. Drink is a fucking menace. Drake <laughs> is a menace. Hey. Drake showing you playing chestnut checkers. He's showing you playing chestnut checkers. He's showing you he was he really bought that shit. Y'all thought he wouldn't. I better stop playing with that nigga because just because he be having writers and shit for his stuff don't mean he can't rap. Beyonce has writers. Kanye West had writers. Kanye, I was just finna, <coughs> Drake I was gonna wrote go, a song for Kanye I was going to go down the line. Kanye West had writers. There's a lot There's of a lot of If you check out old albums, there's a lot of accredited yeah. on there for writing. So mm -hmm. y'all better be careful. Y'all know what y'all talking about that time, but let's get it. Still, you gotta show this fucking aisle who's boss on the west. Now's the time to really make a power move. Cause right now it's looking like you writing out the game plan on how to lose. How to bark up the wrong tree and then get your head popped in a crowded room. World is watching this chess game, but are you out of moves? That you know the DOG never fucking doubted you. But right now it seems like you posted up without a clue of what the fuck you about to do. Yeah, um, that's the truth. 
I'm definitely about to come around the land gang and let my fucking bow move. Shitting on you Damn. niggas from a whole different altitude. Mm. High up in the sky like I'm Howard Hughes. The first one really only took me an hour or two. The next one is really about to bring out the coward in you. But now we gotta wait a fucking week. Cause Taylor Swift is your new top. And if you about to drop, she gotta approve. This girl really about to make you act like you not in a feud. She Damn. tailor made your schedule with Ant. You out of the loop. Hate all you corporate industry puppets. I'm not in the mood. I love it when you niggas talk loose like I'm not in the room. Since like that, your tone changed a little. You not as enthused. How are you not in the booth? It feel like you kind of removed. You nah, K Dot, you gotta respond or fight this nigga. It's one or the other. You gotta respond. What you doing, respond bro? Respond or fight either one, nigga, because this nigga said <laughs> I done Taylor. Lost, I done lost Cole. He said Taylor Swift is not letting you do this, nigga. That's, That's what why he I'm said. He true. said you can't crazy. do it without her approval. It's crazy. She your massa. That's what he's saying. She your massa. BBL Drake is saying that. You said BBL Drake. That's what Rick Ross got the nigga called saying that shit. Nigga. BBL Drake. That shit is all over Twitter. That's why yeah, I said that shit. That is wild. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> that is wild. I'm trying to let this shit die down. Nah, nah, nah. Not this time, nigga. You following through. I guess you need another week to figure out how to improve. What the fuck is taking so long? We waiting on you. The rest of y'all are definitely involved. Y'all getting it too. Soon as you get the courage to drop, I'm out on the loose. On the loose. Yeah. Shout out to Taylor Swift. Biggest gangster in the music game right now. You know, I move my album when she drop. I said that already, girl. Dropped. She about to make me run do a Millie Rock on your head, top. Bro. She got the whole PG laying on me. Nah, I ain't gonna lie. If I was an artist and I told no Taylor finna drop an album, yeah, I'm man. not dropping the same time as her, bro. Yeah, yeah, that's why. The I'll... fucking Swifties is they be running shit. Her bro. Beyonce, I'm not dropping my shit. I'm that not, shit. bro. Beyonce be surprising niggas album. That shit still be selling out. I'm not. I will definitely rearrange my shit around them. Well, that hear me. Well, I'm calling my A and R all immediately. A, hey, make sure. You don't drop when Taylor drop. We gonna get her like a month to get that out the way. To get that out the way, and then we'll drop, bro. I'm dead ass. I did not know. I did not know niggas rocked with her like that until like two years ago, oh boy. boy. Crazy. Oh boy. They talk about she seemed better than Whitney Houston. I was a mind. That killed me when they said that. I, said, I remember that. Oh I said, my you, God. A, you a lie in a seven halves, nigga. <laughs> I stand facts. facts, yeah. Facts. She can say, but nah. Shit, my bad. <laughs> nah, you good. She can say, but nah. She ain't touching with me. Let's not do that. <laughs> At Let's all. Not, don't disrespect that. Because I'll fire off somebody. Oh, and she, she built like a shortstop. Like, I know you in that NY apartment. You struggling right now. I know it. Damn. In a notepad doing lyrical gymnastics, my boy. You better have a motherfucking quintuple entendre on that shit. Some shit I don't even understand. Like... <laughs> This shit better be crazy. We waiting on you. Yo. Nah, this nigga Drake said He says said, you I better want, have a triple on top. He said, I don't even I want understand. this smoke. That man said, I want something. You need a triple on top or something. Or otherwise, get out my damn face. He said, you got to bring something that's going to make me confused. <laughs> that man crazy. That's wild. You got to you gotta come with something hard or get out my face, basically. Drake dared you to come with something and he said it better be good <laughs> it better make me go down cause I got something he said he's like this next one though he said it in the song I got another one I thought he was gonna come back with that beat he did at the end of the other song <laughs> that'd been crazy he said hey look I got something locked in the chamber. He said, oh, don't think I forgot about the rest of y'all niggas. I got something for all y'all. Definitely did say all oh, y'all catching it. <laughs> Rick Ross, BBL Drake, I'm coming for your fat ass. <laughs> Rick Ross fat ass. <laughs> if he start off the song with that, if he do what he did to Metro, I'm going to die. I'm going to die laughing because that Metro should still get played. Metro can't do shit. Yeah, Metro can't do Ain't shit. Ain't nothing he can do. <laughs> Unless he gonna get in the booth. make more baits for future. No. Unless he gonna get in the booth and say something, nigga. You can't do shit but what he sold you. Shut your whole ass up and make <laughs> some drums, nigga. Exactly. Your ass can't he do shit. He didn't even get no bars. Just, he stopped rapping. Hey, Metro, shut the fuck. Shut your whole ass up and make some drums, nigga. He stopped rapping. Bro, you he can't do shit. And they been clowning this man since. Because that shit was funny as fuck. Now they got the mariachi song on that TikTok. Shit was fucked up. 
Bro. The Metro's, it can, they getting at you from all sides. Metro in a dark room right now. Hello, <laughs> darkness, my old friend. I was going to make some beats anyway, this bitch-ass nigga. That TikTok Future. that I sent y'all, that nigga was like, hey, turn that shit on. Then they got, do, 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 do. he's like, you doing what he told you to do. Metro, no. <laughs> Metro, stop. <laughs> stop. I see someone, somebody did a skit where he's getting in the booth. They were like, Metro, get out the booth, bro. He's like, no, I got to respond. He's like, Metro, this ain't you. Come on. No, I was like, it's going to be soft. Come on, man. He's like, it's going to be lame. Come on. He's like, I don't know what to do. He's like, just ignore it, brother. Damn, so he just got to take the L. That is one nigga that just got to take the L. What's he going to do? Make beats and put who on it? It's future. And then they go just, cook. And they go cook future. Unless he just get in the booth and have somebody future like uh, they did for Easy E. Yeah, mm. like cruising down the street when they had that nigga say that shit. From my six like, had him, do you come up with some lyrics? I tell you how to deliver it, and you. But who gonna do it for him? Shit. Future? He got he a fucking beat maker. I'm who can saying, he can get in? Gotta get damn near. Who, I'm saying who beefing with Drake right now? Cause you know that shit gonna get around, and then Drake gonna throw shots at that nigga. You right. So like, if you if you like a, a nigga that can rap, I, you can you can get in the ring with anybody. That's why Kendrick, <sighs> Cole, I don't know, Cole, you hurt my heart, nigga. You really hurt me. But anyway, I mean, he he did what he was supposed to do. He got in there and responded. Apologize, almost but he everything. If, hey, you can't tell that nigga if that's on his conscience. He got he got to if he, that was a weighing on his. To con- say he's not in the big three no more. It hurt. That that's crazy. But if you know how shit is, if some weighing on your conscience, you gonna have to let it out. That's what that's. I can't knock. I can't knock him for it. I'm not gonna do it, but I can't knock him for it. I know you can't relate. Yeah. He was wild for the two pocket Snoop Dogg shit. No, nah, that shit is fucking wild. I wonder how Snoop feel about this. Like, when did I do this? <laughs> Hey, nephew, leave me. Please leave me out of this. I had nothing to do with this. What are you doing? Hey, nephew, don't do that. You know that's my nephew. Just like y'all, my nephew. Y'all need to come together. It's Snoop, because, you know, Snoop about peace right now. Mm-hmm. He's like, y'all need to come together and squash this if it's real beef. You know what I'm saying? But don't be using me in the beef. <laughs> <laughs> don't be doing that. But anyway, y'all, let us know how you feel about it. I think it's hard, and I think K-Dot need to respond. That's K-Dot need to respond, bro. Fight that's, back. That's my Fight opinion. Fight back. That's my opinion. He uh, he said what he said, and Drake dropped a song, and now he dropped another one. This is literally this. If you're going to rap nowadays, and I know some people are going to say, no, hip-hop. No, it, it now it's time-sensitive. I'm not going to lie. It's time since, like, if he come out with something two months from now, we're going to be like, bro. That's too late. We're going to be like, I mean, it's, if it's fire, we're still going to be like, that's fire. But we're going to be like, damn, that was too much, bro. Come on now. I'm just saying, K-Dot said, K-Dot, just like Cole used to say, he smoked niggas on mics. If you smoking niggas on mics, all you got to do, to be honest, I'd have did some slick shit and challenged them, both of them, to get on the song. we all going to get on the song. We're going to sell this shit once and for all. We can do a song, we can do a mixtape, what y'all trying to do? And we all just going, we going to see who, we going to do 10 songs on this mixtape, and we going to try to eat each other up on each song. We ain't even got to talk about each other, we just, who got the best bars on each song? That shit would go crazy. That shit would get sold out. But it, anyway, man, like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you know we post, because we post two to three videos every day, sometimes even four. And like I said before, in case you ain't been here and another catch bet don't work, just come to the side. We got a Drake playlist, all the Drake content we've ever had to be in there. All the other diss songs that people have done, except for Rick Ross. We ain't even react to that, I'm not going to lie. We'll be in there. Oh, we didn't. Nope. And all the other songs. But anyway, because we react to more than just rap. We do country, hip-hop. I said <laughs> rap and hip-hop. Country, K-pop, R&B, all type of stuff, man. We react to almost anything and everything from anime videos to top 10 videos to a whole lot of other stuff. But hey, man, this is Trey the Screen. We NBA reacts, and we'll be back with more reactions. Drake is up right now, man, so K-Dot got to come with something else. We'll highlight y'all later. Peace.